I want to share the quick and simple portion control dinner that I'm prepping for dinner this week because I've lost 130 pounds with portion control and kept it off for eight years. And this dinner is going to be 30 minutes and I'm making sheet pan quesadillas. So this is what you're going to need, cutie. A cookie sheet sprayed with cooking spray. Seven whole grain tortillas. I'm using the Dempster's Ancient Grains Tortillas and I took all the biggest ones out of the bag. <laughs> then we need two teaspoons of low sodium taco seasoning. And this is the great value one. I have 12 ounces of cooked ground beef. I heated it up in a pan with half a cup of water and the two teaspoons of taco seasoning. And I simmered it until all the water was pretty much gone. And now presto change you, we got some lean ground beef. We need 180 grams of light cheese. This is the marble from Great Value. And I love finely shredding my cheese because I feel like you get more. I just use the fine shredder side on a shredder, on the cheese shredder. We need six tablespoons of sliced green onion, six tablespoons of sliced black olives, and I'm using the great value kind, and then half a cup of chopped tomato. And this is going to be portioned into six perfect servings and we're going to be serving these sassanai with some fat-free sour cream, two tablespoons a serving, and some salsa. This is the medium, thick, and chunky from Old El Paso. It was on sale, so we got this one. Two tablespoons for that. So the oven has been preheated to 425 degrees, and this is what we're gonna do. Um, I'm gonna lay these tortillas out so that they overlap each other. So I'm going to leave some hangage on the sides, do the sides first, and then go like so. We just wanna do it so that there's no gap and then it'll fold over really nicely like that. Yep, that looks about good. Okay, so I think I'm happy with that. Now I'm gonna lay the beef down over top, and then I'm just gonna spread it evenly over the bottom like that. Perfect. Oh, this smells so good. Okay, then tomato next. Just sprinkle them over top. And like quesadillas has been a staple, like Sassy, my husband, we've both lost 130 pounds with portion control and um, some quesadilla action was a staple while we were losing weight because they're so tasty and that's what this is about. Loving the food but eating less in portion, that's how you know we were able to get the weight off and keep it off. So next let's put some green onion. I'm gonna do about half and then I'm gonna put the cheese over top. There we go. I love the finely shredding because look at how like much it looks like you get. And it's only like, you know, six servings worth. So let's put the rest of the green onion on and then some black olives. Oh, I love these. I used to eat cans of these when I was little. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I can eat this right now, all right? Look how good that looks. How can you not look forward to that? Oh my goodness. Okay, so now we're gonna take that seventh tortilla and place it right in the middle to prevent any gap and then put the sides, the sides first, like so, and then fold everything else over like that. And then the trick to get it to hold its shape is I'm gonna take another baking sheet and put it right over top. Let me just do a little finagling. Beautiful. So I'm gonna bake this for about 
20 minutes so that everything crisps up and all the cheese melts and everything. But I'm gonna check it halfway through just to see how it's doing. And I'm gonna remove this pan the last five minutes just so that the top gets all crispy. So let's do it, cutie. That's a genius idea. I finally figured out after 16 years with you why I married you. Thanks! <laughs> <laughs> I actually, um, I, I can't take credit. I kind of got the idea off Pinterest and I was like, hey, that's cool. Let's put a sheet pan over top. <laughs> I'll take credit though. Oh, thanks! Yeah, I'm so smart. <laughs> Portion control literally saved my life. I used to weigh 275 pounds and my weight was causing me serious health problems. Like I had sleep apnea so bad. I needed a machine to help me breathe at night. And I knew like if I didn't do something, my life was gonna be at risk every day that I stayed that weight. But I had emotional eating and any sort of like calorie counting, number tracking, it triggered the emotional eating. So I started looking at portion control which allowed me to eat the things that I loved, but just less of them. And so this sheet pan dinner is perfect. I'm gonna slice it into six and it's perfectly portioned. Once I'm done my portion, that's done. I get a tasty meal in portion. It helps me eat in a calorie deficit and I don't have to do any tracking. So there was no triggering of the emotional eating and it allowed me to work all through all the stuff of why I used the food in the first place. Again, having tasty meals was a thing. Portion control and meals that I loved because in the past I just ate things I didn't like but I thought I needed to eat them because they were for weight loss. But I learned I can eat things I enjoy and lose weight at the same time. And if you wanna know like more about the exact portions and meals that I ate to lose the weight, you can buy my weight loss ebook. It's called The First 50. The link's in the description below and code Nicole will save you 10%. Also, I have Huddled. This is H. This is the back of it. This is HTLT Seps. They just came out with this really cool G coffee creamer. It has three and a half grams of milk protein per scoop. It's mocha latte flavor, which is quite delicious. And it has new tropics in it, which is really good for like focus and mental clarity and um, memory, which is good because I'm gonna be turning 40 like tomorrow and I definitely need that. Code Nicole will save you 10% and the link is down below. Also, if you love collagen, like I do, I used to take it separate until this came out. They also came out with Collagen Plus. So they have a chocolate milkshake flavor and a homemade vanilla, 20 grams of protein per scoop plus the collagen. And you guys are always asking like how I get really healthy nails and hair and skin. It's because I take collagen. So if you want, it's a two in one -y. and it's code Nicole again, we'll save you 10%. Okay, so it ended up taking 25 minutes total at 425 degrees, 20 minutes with the baking sheet over top, and the last five minutes with the baking sheet off. So I'm gonna slice it down the middle uh, this way first. It looks beautiful. Oh yeah, it smells good. Crisped up really nice. There we go. And then I'm gonna slice it into, I want six, so we'll go like like that, and then like this. Beautiful. So that's like six servings, and then I don't know if we want to make them smaller, Sass, or you want to leave them big and cute. All right, okay. Oh. oh, that looks amazing. Look at all the stuff in there. Oh. <gasps> that looks cute. Six servings, my friends, for six portions. And then I'll show you all the sour cream and salsa dips I'm gonna do on the side. Put one on my plate for tonight because I'm going to have one for dinner. And then I'm gonna stack one in each of my takeaway containers for the week. And I'm also, oops, this one needs a little help here. There we go. Beauty. Hey, don't lose any of the sweetness. Beautiful. And then this one, and then I'm gonna put another one on the plate because Sasaruni's gonna have one for dinner too. 
Okay, so on the side, I'm going to be doing two tablespoons of salsa, like that, and then two tablespoons of sour cream. And I like these because I like to be fancy. So we'll do something like that. And then I'll be putting these in, you know, the containers alongside. And Sassy, you need a cute little sour cream and salsa for yours. All right, the friends, so this is perfect portion, six meals. And we've got for a whole one serving of the quesadilla with all the dipping sauces, two tablespoons of each. It's 440 calories, 17 grams of fat, 38 grams of carbs, and 31 grams of protein. Beautiful, tasty portion control meal. Dieting does not have to be a punishment. We got that sign right up there because we had to remind ourselves of that all the time. You're allowed to enjoy your food and you're allowed to eat what you like and every day love life, wake up, love it. It shouldn't be a punishment, it shouldn't feel hard because if you're not having fun, you're not getting it done. Watch this vid and this vid for more sustainable weight loss tips that are fun that you can do forever so that we can do it life. Thanks for watching. Thanks for your support. Love you. Peace and I'll catch you in the next vid. Yeah. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.